It's good. God is good. God is good. I'm happy. It is working. So, yes, continue inviting your, your friends. Hi, hi. How are you? <laughs> Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. More hearts. Uh, everyone punching the hearts. Today we are going to paralyze every wicked of the of every day. We are going to paralyze the wicked of the the, the 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 weapon of the wicked. Yes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. God is great. God is good. Thank you. Thank you. Keep on, keep on, keep on coming. God is good. Yes, Hallelujah. I like. Uh, I, I'm. I'm coming back to Periscope. I like Periscope now. It's coming good. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Praise the name of Jesus. Yes, God. I. I want to thank God. I praise God for everyone that have joined. God is good. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. I welcome you, God. I thank you, Father. I give you glory and honor in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I worship you. Lord, I honor you. Lord, I glorify your name. I thank you, Father. I thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Praise Jesus. Yes, Lord, my God. I want to thank you, Father. You are a great God. Welcome your presence, O Master, King of glory, King of heaven. I stand before your presence to acknowledge your name and thank you, Lord. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. Uh, welcome again. This is your host, Prophetess Dr. Christine Isiki. Welcome you from Overcomers Deliverance and Healing Ministry. Uh, Brampton, Ontario, Canada. Welcome. Um, uh, today, the subject I'm going to talk to you is called paralyzing, para, para, paralyze, paralyze the weapon of the wicked. Paralyze the, the weapon of the wicked. If you paralyze the weapon of the wicked, the wicked will not have a weapon to fight, to fight you. If you paralyze the weapon of the wicked, the, the, the wicked will not have any weapon to fight you. Therefore, people of God, I thank you for this subject. I thank you. I thank God for this subject. And I thank you those who have come. It is good to paralyze every weapon of the enemy, every weapon of the wicked, because the wicked has weapon to use against you. Now, when they use this weapon, if you paralyze them, you, you destroy them, you render them powerless, it will not function. That's why I'm coming to share with you this message. This message is going to be powerful, powerful message that I've never shared before. This message is going to save so many people. I'm training you how to fight spiritual warfare. I'm training you how to attack the weapon of the wicked. How to, 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 to destroy them, to dismantle them, to render them powerless. I'm teaching you how to silence every mouth of the wicked. How to destroy them in Jesus' name. Yes, God is good. I thank God because I wake up 5 o'clock. I've been praying up to this time. I've been praying very hard. I've been praying serious prayer that I want to help people. I want to help the needs the people the needs the people have. I want to know what what is this affecting many people. People have so many people. People have degrees. People have education, but no job. The child of the devil, children of the devil, are occupying the, their jobs. We will fire those children. We will cut them off, off, off. Uh, uh, and they will die, all of them. Strange children, spirit children, uh, parents' children, uh, parents, pa uh, spirit parents, spirit husband, spirit wife. Today is their end. We we'll kill them. We we'll destroy them. They have to die. They have to be destroyed and be wasted in Jesus' name. People of God, you have suffered so much. Now, when you know how to, to, to destroy this, to paralyze this weapon of the wicked, the wicked would not have any weapon to use against you in Jesus' name. Let's look in the book of Mark. Mark 16, verse 17 to 18. Mark 16, verse 17 to 18. The Bible says, And those signs shall follow them that believe. In my name they shall cast out the devils, or they will cast out demons. They shall speak with the new tongue. You know, 
In the name of Jesus, we are going to cast out every weapon of the wicked, every weapon of the devil, every materials of the devil. In the name of Jesus, we are going to cast out every demons, devilish, witchcraft power. We are going to cast them to come out of your life. We paralyze their, their, their idols. We paralyze their, 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 their powers in the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, we will be praying because this is a prayer, deliverance prayer. We pray that in the name of Jesus Christ, I cast you devil. I cast you demon. I cast you. That is what the Bible says. They said in the name of Jesus, you will cast out the devils and you will speak in the, in the, with the new done. So let's go and cast out the problem you are facing right now. Mention any problem you are facing. If it is sickness, if it is finances, you command the enemy attacking your finances. I paralyze your power. You, you enemy attacking my finances, I paralyze your power. I paralyze your, your activity. I cast them. I cast them in Jesus' name. That's how you will pray. You will pray because look at what the Bible says. Believe. It is only faith. You just believe. You just believe and when you believe it, you receive it in Jesus' name. The Bible says that if you believe, anything you believe by faith, you know faith, faith, you go faith and believe. You can't have faith without believing. You can have faith, but if you don't believe, you are zero work. So you have that faith. Even if your faith is master seed, as small as master seed, it can move mountain. You don't need a big faith to do to go with it. Now start practice. Start casting out demons from your from your life. Start casting devil from your life. It is not one to attack you. I'm going to pray for you, seal you. The devil is not one to do you anything. They are powerless. The power of Jesus, the name of Jesus is a strong tower. The, the name of Jesus is so powerful. That's what the Bible is telling us. That in the name of Jesus, we cast out the demons. We cast out the devil. That's what the Bible says. Now you see, they shall take up serpents, and if they drink any deadly thing, it shall not hurt them. They shall lay hands on sick, and they shall recover. Now the Bible says, you remember Jesus in in in, in Luke ten verse nineteen. The Bible says Jesus has given us power. Against serpents and scorpions, nothing shall hurt us by all means. Here the Bible says, even, even if we pick them, because we have paralyzed their vandermonds, we have paralyzed their portions, we have paralyzed their, 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 their power, they don't have any power. You know, you know, the serpents, they cannot have power over you. The Bible said, even if you pick it, even if you drink any deadly thing, it will not hurt you. That's what the Bible says. Hallelujah. Jesus is God. Yes. You, the power that you have been given by Jesus, it will paralyze and, and disgrace the, 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 the devil. It will disgrace the enemy completely in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, you powers of darkness, be destroyed. Be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, I want to thank you, Jesus. I praise your name, Jesus. Let's look in the book of uh, the book of James. Hallelujah. Yes, Jesus. James one seventeen. James one seventeen. God is good. Hallelujah. Let's look in the book of James one seventeen. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, God. My God, you are so good. James 1. James 1, 17. Hallelujah. The Bible says, Every good gift and every perfect gift is from above and cometh down from the Father of rights with whom is no variable, var variableness, either shadow of turning. You know, every good gift come from the Father of the light. Every good things come from the Father of the right. The Father of the right has every good things to come to you. The Father of the right, we have two fathers. We have a Father of the right and a Father of the darkness. In the book of John, John the book of John, John 8 verse 44. You will see there is a father there. Let's go there so that we can paralyze this father. Because our father, our father, 
is a father who give a, a good good gift from heaven. So any gift, anything from the father of the darkness, from the father of the rise, shall be destroyed in Jesus' name. Let's look in the book of uh, in the book of uh, in the book of John, John eight, John eight, verse forty four. Hallelujah! Glory be the name of Jesus. Today this message is good. I'm telling you. You see, we have two fathers here. We have the father of the right and the father of darkness. We have two different fathers. That's why I'm telling you today we are going to paralyze a uh, false father. We are going to paralyze a um, uh, spirit parent, spirit father. We are going to destroy every spirit father. The, 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 the father of the darkness, the father of, the, the, the father of, of, of lies is going to be destroyed today. You will paralyze their power. Look at that. Remember James, the book of James says, the father who give good gifts, perfect one, and the father of the right is the father of the right. Who, who is the, our father in heaven? Our father, of our God, of our God, of our Lord Jesus Christ. Who is the father? Now, here, we have a father who is called the devil. Let's look at John 4, John 8, verse 44. John 8, verse 44. Glory be the name of Jesus. The Bible says, You are of your father, the devil. You see? And the, the last of your father, ye, 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 you will do, he was, ye will do, he was a murderer from the beginning, and born not in the truth, because there is no truth in him. When he speaks, a lie is he, he speak it out of his own for he is the liar and the father of all, all of it you see is the father of of lies you know is the father we have two fathers yes we have two fathers we have the father of the, of, of the right and we have the father of the lies look at that yes your father the devil the, the father there's, there's a father which you call the devil and there's a father which who is called god so we are going to paralyze the father who is called the devil the devil is going to be paralyzed all his works yes ye are of your father the devil and the last of your father you do he was good a murderer from the beginning and the board of in the, the truth in the truth Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for writing that. Yes, you see, now this father, we are going to paralyze him. He's not going to function because we have the father of the right. Where the right is signing, the father of darkness will not the rocket there. In the name of Jesus Christ, I come against you, the father of darkness. That is attacking this family. That is claiming you are, they are your children. They are not your children. Every spiritual father, I command you to die. Every spiritual mother, I command you to die. Every spiritual children attacking your children, attacking your life, let them die. Let them be destroyed. I cut them off. I cut them off. I cut them off in Jesus' name. This, uh, these children, strange children, spirit children, they are the children who introduce your children to, 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 to this weed, smoking, drugs. When they come there, when you dream these children, or you see children in your dreams, they are not ordinary children. They are spirit children. They are children from the devil. You see, the father has is, is, is the devil. So this father has children, and these are the children called strange children. When they come into your life, you will not have your children. If you have your children, they will make sure that these children, they are, they are taking uh, uh, drinks, they are taking drugs, they are smoking weed, and they will be wasted because they are very jealous. If you have a, a spiritual mother, a spiritual parents, a spiritual father, uh, the, the father who is who is claiming you are you are their daughter and they are not their daughter. I mean that is spirit, spirit father, not the spiritual mother or a spiritual father. I mean spiritual father who claim that they, they claim you that they are they are, they are you are you are their children. I command every spirit father to die and be destroyed from your life in Jesus' name. This they will come 
and they will take everything from you. They claim you feed them. Everything you have, they, they take from you. So you, your work is, you suffer so much. They take your job. They take everything. Because they don't want you, even if you have your parents, they don't want you to see their parents. That's why many children, they don't talk with their own parents. Children, they fight with their parents all the time. Why? Because Spirit Father has taken them. That's why I'm telling you this video is going to help so many people, especially uh, children, parents who does not talk with their children, who does not have a good relationship with their with their own parents. They are not. It is not their problem. They, there is a spirit who has taken them. The spirit children or the spirit uh, father. The spirit father. The spirit parents. They have taken over. When they have taken over, there is no way relationship will die so we have to disgrace them we have to bind them we have to paralyze them spirit father spirit parents die 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 in the name of jesus die in the name of jesus die die by fire die 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 you must die be cut off and be rendered powerless you have no place you, you, you we, have, we have destroyed every weapon you are using in the mighty name of jesus in the name of jesus Hallelujah. Let's look on another scripture. I'm going to pray for you. Let's look on a, a, another scripture from the book of Psalms 1, 140, verse 4 to 5. Psalms 140, verse 4 to 5. The Bible says, Keep me, O Lord, from the hands of the wicked. Preserve me from the fire and men who are purposed to make my steps stumble. The proud have hide the snail for me and the cords. Now, God is going to destroy them. God is going to keep you. God is going to keep you. God is going to keep you in the mighty name of Jesus. God is going to keep you from fire and from wicked people, from weapon, from the weapon of the enemies in the name of Jesus. Uh, if somebody is pressing a curse on you, where you are, you you need you need to 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 refer the scriptures. You need to to refer very aggressive scriptures. A curse. A, a, a costless shall not come. Help me with this scripture. Use this scripture because the curse cannot work. You command every curse that any witch, any evil that has been done against you, especially when you are sleeping. If they put a curse on you, let that curse be broken into pieces. Let it be rendered powerless in the name of Jesus. Disgrace and paralyze their curses. You paralyze them. Remember that scripture, the memory scripture. You must make sure that the scripture is working live with you. Don't let the weapon of the wicked to work on your life. Let those, because the Bible said, yes, the Bible said that no weapon formed against you shall prosper. No weapon of the devil, let it be paralyzed. The weapon of the wicked, let them paralyze in Jesus' name. Psalms 144, with Psalms 140, verse 4 and 5. That's what it says. God is going to protect you. From the fire and man, from evil people, they will not affect your life. Their weapon will, will go zero. They will not affect you in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Let their weapon be paralyzed and be landed powerless in the name of Jesus. Deprogram their, 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 their weapon in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I praise your name, God. I want to thank you, Jesus. I bless your name, O God, my Father. I want to pray that God will deliver you in Jesus' name. Every problem initiated and expanded be paralyzed in the name of Jesus. Every problem, every problem that has been initiated by the wicked, by the wicked weapon, by the weapon of the wicked, let it be paralyzed. Let it be lendered the powerless in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. You know, the proud have hide this now for you to catch you let that is the first now they are they are, they are prepared for you let it catch themselves they drop their they are prepared for you let it catch themselves destroy their weapon destroy their drop they just destroy their their snail they will not affect you deprogram the them in jesus name deprogram every powers of witchcraft deprogrammed every evil that is working against you in jesus name in the mighty name of jesus all quenches of spiritual power i lend you powerless i lend you impotent in the mighty name of jesus that's how you destroy all weapon of the wicked i render you impotent i quench you with the quench of fire in the name of quench quencher 
quench the, the, the weapon of the wicked and destroy them. Let them be rendered impotent. Let them be rendered powerless in Jesus' name. Pray like this. Every wicked, every weapon of the wicked, every weapon of the weak, every weapon of the wicked, possession, calling satanic power, be exposed and be rendered powerless in the name of Jesus. They have to expose and be rendered powerless in the name of Jesus. Every weapon of the wicked in your position, calling, calling satanic power, let them be paralyzed and be rendered powerless in Jesus' name. Every weapon of, of the wicked in your possession, calling satanic power, be exposed and be destroyed in the name of Jesus. You might have a weapon of the devil and you don't know. The weapon of the devil can be discouragement, can be frustration, can be angry. You know, that is a weapon of the devil. The, that, that weapon itself, fear, that is a big weapon. That is a weapon of the devil. If the devil has placed the, the spirit of fear in you, that is his weapon. And that is a dangerous thing. If he has put, uh, uh, given you, if he has put a weapon of discouragement, that is a big weapon. You are so discouraged, you want to give up. Some, somebody called me yesterday. She said she wants to give up. I said, you give up to go where? Where are you going? Are you going to kill yourself? Yes, I'm tired. I'm tired. I want to give up. I said, okay. That is a big discouragement weapon you have been given. Now you are the one to destroy yourself, yourself. You have to paralyze that weapon. You paralyze the, you weapon of discouragement. I know I'm a child of God. God has not failed me. It is me who has failed. Therefore, I, I claim restoration. I destroy. You repent. People of God, repent and ask God to restore back your, 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 your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. You repent. If you are struggling, you are battling for something, try to repent and ask God, God, here I am afresh. Here I am, I am wrong. All this uh, negative that I've been thinking, I am now taking a step of faith. I paralyze anything that is working in me right now. I paralyze them and render them powerless. Any weapon of the devil that is operating in my life, I destroy you. I bind you. I, I, I command you to die right now, now, now. Yeah? You, you say like that. You become very angry. Holy madness. You have to refuse in the mighty name of Jesus. You command every stop and pursue. I command you. I command your ways to be slavery. And I ask the angel of the God to pursue you. You call the angels of God to start pursue the, 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 stop, on, the stop on problem. The stop on pursuers. The stop on that, that does not want to go. You use paralyze. I paralyze you. I render you powerless. I am calling the angels of God to, to, to purchase you, to render you powerless, to destroy you in Jesus' name. Yes, you have to be very angry. You don't joke with the enemy. That has placed a weapon on you, and this weapon wants to destroy you. Many people, they give up, and they decided to do wrong things. At the end, they, 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 they die. You don't want to let, you don't let the devil to kill you. Don't let this Lucifer to, to drink your, your blood. Don't let Lucifer to sacrifice you. Don't let the devil. <laughs> don't let the devil to sacrifice you. You are not one to be a thanksgiving turkey of the devil. You know October is coming. So it's, it's preparing to, 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 to eat people. Therefore, paralyze the activity, their weapon. Paralyze them and stop them not functioning, not to prosper in Jesus' name. Tell them you will not prosper, you will not function in my life. I have decided, I've changed my mind. God is good, I'm wrong. God is good, I am the one who have a problem. Therefore, God forgive me. Forgive me, forget, reborn again. Yes, what's wrong in that? Yes, I'm a Kenyan. Is there, is there any problem? Do you have any problem with, in that? Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Lord, I want to thank you, Jesus. I thank you. I thank you. I thank you, Lord. You are a good God in the name of Jesus. Yes, hallelujah. Your problem, your problem shall die. Your problem shall be destroyed in Jesus' name. This shall be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Oh, <laughs> Every spiritual parasite, I command you to die in the name of Jesus. Every root of problem, be upset in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ, 
the as the enemy loves casting, let it let it let it come unto him in the name of Jesus. Lord, let the Lord deliver you from the oppression in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, my Father. I want to thank you, Lord. I bless your name, Jesus. As the enemy delighted not to bless, let it be far from him in the name of Jesus. You know the enemy, they 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 delight, they don't bless. The enemy does not bless you. The enemy's work is to destroy and curse you and put a curse and 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 cursing you. So because that is his work, you paralyze their mouth, you command their mouth to be weathered, their words to be destroyed and be rendered powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. As the enemy clothed with the cursing like a garment, so let it come unto his bow like water and like oil unto his bones. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Father. I thank God and I praise God. I glorify God. I lift the name of God up in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you. I bless you. I give you all the glory. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. If you want me to paralyze the enemy that is troubling you, if you want me to pray with you, this enemy that is bothering you until you are giving up, you feel like you, you have no hope. They, it has taken your husband. You have spiritual husband. You have spiritual wife. You have spiritual parents, mother, father. You have spiritual children. You call me, I will destroy them. I will cut them off in the, night, in the name of Jesus. Our number is 905-792-3798. And God will help you in Jesus' name. Don't talk with this enemy. The enemy must be paralyzed and be rendered powerless. Their, their weapon must be, be cut off and be destroyed by fire. They have to be set fire in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. I love you. I love you so much. That's why I want to help you. Call me and we war against this wicked uh, weapon of the enemy. Wicked of the weapon of the wicked must die, must be destroyed by fire and be rendered powerless in Jesus' name. I want to stop here. God bless you. Thank you very much. Enjoy yourself and have a good time. People of God, I love you so much and there's nothing I can do about it. Call me and I want to pray with you in Jesus' name. Uh, I might come today or tomorrow. God willing, we we are, we are want to pray in tongues. We are want to pray honorary prayers. We will not do anything just to pray tongues. Because you remember, the Bible says here, uh, believers, we want to do this, as the Bible says in Mark 16, verse 17, in Mark, Mark 16, 17 to 18, the Bible says, they shall speak with the new tongue. We will speak tongues. We will speak to the devil tongues because the devil does not hear. When you speak in tongues, you are cursing him, you are cutting him, you are destroying. So tomorrow, or sometimes midnight today, we are going to pray fire prayer, only speaking the tongue, and you will see. We will spend a half an hour speaking in tongues. You will see how your life will change. If you don't know how to speak in tongues, I will give you the words to say. You stick on those words. You will see fire falling down and consuming your enemy. The fire of Elijah that consumed the enemy, it will fall and consume your enemies. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't want to continue. We will come tonight. Periscope will be on tonight and popcorn and, 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 and YouTube. God bless you so much.